What up guys? So it's the next day now and I'm still currently chilling in Lausanne But I think it's gonna rain today, that's why I put on my rain jacket Which I actually bought while I was here um, And I decided, you know what, just let me take it just to be safe Because yesterday it was raining a lot And I was the only idiot out of us three who didn't have a rain jacket Anyways, right now we're gonna head down to have some breakfast And then we're gonna check out the hotel and make our way to Interlaken Thanks bro, appreciate that yeah. You like to be part of the vlogs, yeah? Yep As you can see, we're all checked out now. You gonna miss this room, bro? No. Why not? This room's lovely. No, because uh, every hotel is gonna become nicer and nicer and nicer. All right, well, you just jinxed it now, so fingers okay. crossed the next hotel's nice, otherwise we're gonna have a hole in the floor. <laughs> and over here, on the left, we have Omran's big mother fudger. Over here, he's ready to go down, race to the end. Over here, we got little dynamite. And over here, we got medium-sized average Joe. Who do you think's gonna win, bro? Me. Think you're gonna win? Yes. All right, you ready? On your marks, get set, go! And run, motherfucker, just get in the lead! Average Joe's head, average Joe's head! Little dynamite's behind him, run! He's going, 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 and it's average Joe with the lead! Little dynamite had a little bit of casualties and a little bit of an accident on the way down, but all is okay. <laughs> Congratulations to the winner. We have, we have, we have. The winner is. I told you. The winner is Average Joe. <laughs> so before we started our journey, we decided to go pick up some Starbucks, which I'm on, is currently drinking. And now the fatty wants to have some ice cream. Man, this is the best place to get ice. Is it actually that good though? Yeah, yeah. What flavor are you gonna get? I don't know. Do you have to take photos of everything? Are you mad? I thought you were gonna reply saying, do you have to take videos of everything? And my answer would have been yes, bitch. Drink, sipping on the drink. Guys, I'm one freaking subscriber away from 20k. This is insane. Come on, one more person, just do it. Hit the subscribe button, please. That's amazing, fucking dude. So guys, we just stopped along the way to Interlaken to the to the hotel we're going to stay because Omran said that there's this really nice waterfall here and he wants to obviously take some photos and I don't really mind because I would love to see it and I think I can hear it to be honest with you. It's, I hear like a really sound of like gushing water, so I'm pretty sure that's the waterfall. Now it was a really nice hike and we saw some really nice views and Omran took some amazing photos. So once again, check out his Instagram because it's going to be sick. We're currently at this place called Alpin Ra and basically these lovely people, we contacted them in regards to doing like some activities here and hopefully tomorrow we'll be doing something called canyoning which is something I didn't even know existed until Omran mentioned it to me which is basically this thing where you like jump from like rocks into water and it's like fast paced, it's like really really fun. So all of us are going to go there tomorrow, um, but we've been talking to this lovely lady discussing it. I'm going to introduce you to her in the vlogs. Let me, let me, let me bring her. This lady right here, her name is Julie. She's a very Hi, nice yeah. lady. She speaks like 80 languages, literally. <laughs> How many do you speak? You speak German, German English, English, and Arabic. Arabic. Say something in Arabic. Yeah. Salam alaikum. Keep alik. Tazorne fi intilak and aiza shofakom. Yalla. <laughs> See how good Arabic is? She's putting me to shame and I'm half Arabic. This is my website, www.interlakenforarabs.com. I'm going to put the link in the description, so if any of you guys are coming here from anywhere around the world and you need preferably Arabic languaging, she's the one to help you out. Also on her website it has halal restaurants as well, which is obviously it's going to be hard to find halal restaurants if you don't know where they are here, so that's cool. And uh, as well, we might be doing something today, we might be doing some kayaking or something, it depends. Because Oman's kind of got a little boo-boo on his foot. We just left and we booked canyoning, so we're going to be going there tomorrow. I'm really excited about it, but 
the lovely lady Julie, she also told us about this really nice restaurant, which is all the way at the top over there. Can you see it? It's like right there. So we're trying to figure out how to get up there. I'm gonna go have some food up there because it's gonna be really cool. Like the view's gonna be insane. So we just arrived at the restaurant and it looks so beautiful. It's like a really nice old school building. And we're gonna go sit down, have something to eat with this wonderful view behind us, as you can see. So we just arrived in our hotel in Interlaken, and I'm not gonna lie, this hotel, in terms of looks, is a lot nicer, but the view isn't the greatest. So I thought I'd give you guys a little updated room tour. So as you walk in, you've got a little mirror over here for when you wanna check yourself out, you know, give yourself those little, woo. And then over here, we got some wardrobes, which I don't think any of us are gonna use because we're really not bothered to take stuff out of our suitcase. We got another wardrobe. This time we have a safe, which is pretty cool. Our last one didn't have a safe, um, but thankfully no one stole anything. Then over here we got a bathroom again. Actually, a pretty nice bathroom. I'm not sure about the pressure, which is really important. Let's 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 give it a little. Let's give it a little whirl. See how it is. Not bad, not bad. Over here we got the toilet, the sink, another big mirror, the basic stuff. Oh, they got one of these mirrors. Woo! Then over here we got Omran's fat suitcase, which is literally taking up the whole bloody trolley. Then over here we got Omran's bed, we got the butters guy over here, and then I'm sleeping next to Bay again. Then Mohammed Omar is alone, he's on this massive double-sized bed all to himself. How do you feel having a bed all to yourself? Feeling great. Then over here we got this little levitating sort of side table, little light over here. And then we got this guy again. Can you move please? Thanks. And then over here we got a nice plasma TV. Again, with a brand, Panasonic. That's a good brand, so I'll give them that. Props to them. Then over here we got these two chairs which no one will be using. Liar. What do you Liar. mean liar? I'm using it. Alright, well Omran will be using it, the rest of us won't. And then my most favourite part of this whole hotel, even though the view isn't the greatest, this is like one of these like really high sitting balconies, where it's like on the roof of like the building. Like, let me show you guys. Hold this on Omran for a yep. second. One second, let me get up. So you can sit here and like chill, so like for example, I can be like on the edge here, and then they'll be... How do you feel, Karim? Can you sleep here outside? We gotta sleep here inside, okay? <laughs> Say please! Say please! Also, I mean, I can, okay, okay, now you're, you're allowed then. You've been a good boy. No, no, Malik, Malik, Malik. Wallah, wallah, don't push me, don't push me, wallah. Push me. Ay! One thing I don't like about Switzerland, and this is just me as a preference, I don't like how everything is closed. Like right now, what time is it? Is it nine o'clock yet? It's uh, nine, yeah. Yeah, it's nine o'clock, okay? But we came out here about, say, half an hour ago, so like 8.30ish, and everything's closed. Like all the shops here are closed. Personally, I like things to be open later because I like to go out in the night time. I'm more of a night owl. I'm not like a morning person. But everything here closes like super early. Can you? Swiss knives. Swiss knives. Yeah. yeah, Swiss knives. Swiss knives, Kareem. Swiss knives. If you know what I mean. No. That's an inside joke, so we'll leave that alone. But anyway, what I was going to say is, if you guys ever come to Switzerland, make sure that you get up early in the morning, because if you don't, you will have nothing to do during the day, because everything opens super early and closes super early. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's amore. Nee, 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 nee. Now that is a pizza. In comparison to the one we had in top of that building, which I don't even want to talk about because how bad it was. Uh, that, do you want to go there? Go for the views. Yeah, don't eat the food. Don't eat the food. How is it? Well, maybe this is the best result that I ever tasted. No, wait, okay, let me get a bit of that bad boy over there. Let me get some of that. 
I regret my decision. I should have got that. All right, guys, so we're all done at the restaurant. And honestly, I'm not even like exaggerating. That food was so freaking good, guys. If you live in Interlaken or anywhere near, or you come here to visit, you have to go to this restaurant right here. Ristorante Rialto Pizzeria. This place is phenomenal. What would you give it out of 10? Nine, you give yeah, it a nine. It's, it's that good, man. Well, you give it a nine. What about you? What would you give it out of 10? ten? You give it a 10. Yeah. I'm gonna be honest, I'll give it a nine, but if I had his food, because I tried his risotto and it was unbelievable. If I have that tomorrow and it's as good as it was today, I think I'm gonna have to jump it up to like a 9.5, 10, because honestly, the food there was so good and it wasn't even that expensive, like it was reasonably priced. Like, long story short, this restaurant is a yay, the other restaurant is a nay. So we just got back to the hotel. We're gonna have an early night because obviously we have to wake up 7 a.m. tomorrow. But I just wanna say before I go to sleep, thank you guys so much. 20k I really really appreciate it like it means so much to me and it means that we're so so close to getting the silver play button and that that that's that would be a dream come true so I want to say thanks so much and I want to say good night from here so I'll see you guys in the morning good night I'm Ron yeah I love you okay I love you so much bro okay man 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 oh you're so nice Hi, man. I love you so much